everybody, what's up, CSIM Max here, and today I'm going to be doing a little different of a video. So I heard about this game called Apex Legends, and I thought I would try it out. It seems to be attracting lots and lots of players. It's a battle royale, and I thought I'd take it out for a spin. So they won't let me do a battle royale until I complete the train. So I'm to complete the train real quick, and we'll hop into a battle royale. So see you guys then. Okay, so I just completed the tutorial, so we're about to hop in a real battle royale match. So here are a few things. So, the, these legends, these are your characters you are, each one comes with special skills and abilities, and they're all, they all look like pretty cool people, so I'm gonna go with Bloodhound, and you got all these different skins you can put on them, uh, here's your armory, all the guns, and also you can put skins on these, there's different types, you assault rifles, some machine guns, you get it. Then, like, here's, like, the item shop, pretty much, uh, but these, like, these come back every, every so many hours or whatever. I'm not sure what these are, so, you can also buy more legends, like, your characters you are, and these are just, like, Apex coins you use to buy stuff in-game. Okay, then. So, let's, yeah, so, hop in here, and let's get into this. Okay, so we just got a server and looks like you spot you get the spirit. And now you gotta choose your uh character. Now I'm gonna stick with the left We got this round squared out. All your other teammates, they also choose their character. Like I said, it looks like you do trios. I think that's what it is. So let's do this. So I'm the guy in the middle, she's the Maddox, the Bloodhound, and I haven't played this before, I, oh, I have, I've only taken the uh, tutorial, so I'm gonna check this out, see how well I do, so we're in some kind of bus it looks like. Okay. Um. This is a good LZ! Looks like they want to go down there. I will choose. This might be a good place to land. Prepare for battle. There we go. Okay, the controls from the tutorial they seem pretty basic. Um, yeah, there's a lot of different stuff you can wear, like, gun add-ons and all that good stuff. Firing. But I can't Reloading. seem to find Reloading. Tango's down. Reloading. Attention. First blood. Reloading. First blood. Should've seen that coming. Reloading. Got a gun. Down another yep, target. Yep, pistol. And you can hold... Uh, two guns at a time. And you got my shield over here. I think I need a medic. Go try it right. I'm not sure. Can you drive it? Getting shot at. Okay. Reloading. Um. I don't have any extra ammo, it looks like. It looks like I only got what's in the clip. So I'll need to find some ammo. Awesome. Thanks for having my back. Okay, so I'm not really sure what just happened there. Using a med kit. One sec. But marking our surroundings. I did. So, like I said, each person comes with a special ability, but it looks like I just like scanned the area for any, you know, like hostiles. So I really need a new gun because I can't just stick with this pistol. 
A big thing about this that's different than uh, Fortnite is that there's no building, and I really like building, but I mean, I don't know. Because I always feel like so helpless when I'm getting shot at and everything. And also, I really like, what I really liked about uh, Fortnite is that all, not everything's like, super confusing, like you don't got all these major scopes and, you know, like, stocks or, Gonna see if there's loot here. I'm not sure what I just said there, stocks or whatever. Like, you know the thing that goes on the back of the gun, like those things? And, but Fortnite just seems so much more, uh, easier to use. Like, see, I have, my, I have my super ability available. It's the thing at the bottom, at, in, at the bottom middle. Not really sure what it does, but we can find out. So, I'm assuming there's, like, some sort of storm that we have to deal with as well. Not really sure about everything else. So, we have looking for some loot here. Red grenade art. I'm gonna go with the frag grenade. Actually, what is this? I need shields. Okay, um. So yeah, those are your grenades, it looks like. Yeah, those are grenades. Cool. At the top right, you can see how many people are left, and right below the map, you can see, uh, like, the time. So I'm pretty sure what the storm is. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, I don't see anybody though. I'm gonna try that scan thing again. Scanning the area. Something green up here. See that? Like on the map. I'll check that out. Body shield here. Level two. You know what I'm seeing? Like a green thing? Oh, whoa. Warning. Closing. That was cool. Since there's like a green thing right there. There it is. Oh, I saw this in tutorial. So what it looks like is when your teammate gets down and like if you don't if you aren't able to revive them, you can pick out what they what they call a teammate banner. And if you bring that over to one of those, you can, like, bring them back. Like, even if they, like, if they get knocked down and you aren't able to revive them, even if they get, like, killed, killed, if, as long as you have their teammate banner, which is what they drop when they die, you can bring it over there and just, uh, literally bring them back to life. Like, not a revive, just literally back. Did I take one? Oh. I heard that. I'm not sure what that is. Like pictures of some heroes or whatever. Okay. Are there guys over here? You can also mark stuff on, on the map. Like, Let's go this way. I can just do that. If you want to remove it, you gotta put it on it and the same button you did to put it on. It's like a place one here. I aim at it and I hit the button that I did to put it on. It just goes away. Okay, um. Pick up. Take that. Okay. Still quite a few people left. There's Give me a sec. Wait, wait. Recharging shields. Let's reposition here. Looks like there's some fight going on. Right over here. Oh, 
Okay, so it looks like I was killed. I'm not sure if my teammates are going to come back for me. Like, when I got, like, he didn't have enough time to revive me because I had already gotten killed. But it looks like he has one my banner. And if he takes it to one of those beacons, I'm pretty sure I'll come back. Those green things on the map, you see them? I'm pretty sure those are things if you bring your teammates' banner to them, it brings them back.
really cool. So yeah, this game seems pretty fun. I'm not sure if I'd say it's better than Fortnite, because, I mean, Fortnite's kind of hard to compare, because Fortnite's just so amazing. But, yeah, it's a pretty fun game. Like, what well, you can do with different characters and skins and all that. So yeah, pretty cool. Really like it. Um, like I said, I don't, don't think it beats Fortnite, but it's a really cool game. So yeah. Well, hope you guys liked the video. Um, yeah, I would download this and try it out, see what you think. And yeah, well, thank you guys for watching, and see you guys later. Bye. Have a good day. God bless.